and what we've heard from these people here today. And uh, Thomas, he didn't need to come to me because his focada was thicker right in the beginning. Because in actual fact, that was something that he felt in his own conscience that he could not taka taka here, the mana, the kawa, or whatever it might be in terms of his own tupuna tonga. And that is uh, a big risk within the industry. I mean, where anywhere he went, that went with a kaupa. Where Dallas and them, what they did in, in Olympia, in Greece, was a kaupapa driven thing. And all of us contributed towards the kaupapa. Um, it wasn't an individual hakahihi thing. And we're very humble that we have been given this position to be able to help each other. All of the people on this panel, I mean, the, new, the whole news thing, the setting up of journalism and that sort of thing, which Derek and them been involved in. It's all part of our whole kaupapa haka piri piri. It's two pakiri tamu. And on that, we ought to be able to share and rejoice in it. At the moment, we're going through a very terrible racist perspective within this nation. And we have to start to take some stand to retain our integrity as Māori for a start. And we have a lot of Pākehā people who feel the same. <coughs> so we need to actually bring those two elements together. It doesn't matter what field we work in. Whether we work in the arts, whether we're working on the roads, whether we're making film. But the important thing is that the integrity under which we do that is dependent entirely on the expertise that is brought to bear.